So last week I put about this same amount of uh, food on ton. I think it's uh, similar to uh, sort of a cross between food on and uh, uh, hard candy, I think it's called. Um, it's having trouble controlling the temperature. I didn't quite understand how, um, where the thermometer got its uh, temperature at. Anyways, uh, so I put the same amount of sugar on last week and I came and checked it today and it was all gone. So this is a new session or new new uh, supply of sugar. Um, you can see here I had some that I had left out over the past week. Um, I think the bees have been eating on that over over the week. It's so a bit less. I don't think it's really rained or snowed here um, since last week. So I think a lot of that has been consumed by the bees. Um, yeah, so I use, I'm using these uh, polystyrene EPS uh, uh, supers for the uh, brood brood chambers. Um, this is what they wintered through. Didn't didn't wrap it at all. Um, although there's this, uh, um, I think it's called a pillow, is what the fellow that gave that I bought this from. Um, I also also insulated the uh, the top of the telescoping lid, and then I also stuck some of this stuff on top. Um, held it down with bricks. I don't know how much that helped, but uh, anyways, uh, yeah. So seems the bees are consuming lots of uh, sugar, and uh, um, which I guess is good. There's a lot of them in the hive, as you can see. They're out flying around. They've been flying around for the past couple of weeks, so they seem to be healthy. Um, yeah. So I'll put these guys, put the pillow back on, see if I can't get these bees back inside. So. Haven't been wearing a veil or, or or anything. They haven't been stinging me, so I think they've been all right. So pretty calm. Hey, Mike. So, anyways, here we go.